for the record, I did go heal at the uh, the Golden Goddess statue, and then Lester died as soon as we fought any new enemies. Um, yeah, I'm just going to avoid you. I don't like fighting the, the mages if I don't have to. But we can head over here, and we can grab ourselves a treasure chest with a chocolate lump in it. Now, if memory serves me correctly... I can talk to you. It's Vega! Because I have done the three previous Shiny Knight quests, Vega will show up here. If Vega doesn't show up for you, you have not completed the quests. You are, oh, the one from, I'm Vega, former solo swordsman. Now I'm a soldier at Gron's Castle. I thought I had what it takes, but here I'm more of a decoration. Glittering sword, glittering armor, glittering helm. I even felt sorry for you because you didn't know their value finally realized what's most important as a knight. You already had it. That's kindness. If you were kind to even an arrogant twit like me. Thank you. I'm sorry. Please take this. And we received a dead bear's gold, which we still don't really know what it is, but people treat it like it's very important. I'm going to get out while the getting is good. I'd like to be self-employed again. Very nice. Uh, technically, we have actually completed another side quest, a fourth uh, Shiny Knight quest. Um, but, well, if he's not there, then you're not going to get it. And we didn't even have to do anything for that one, but we earned it through our merits. Now, after all that, let me take these guys on again and, and heal, and we'll see if Lester survives this time. What do you know, he made it this time. Now we can head up here, and we can use the gold key that we got open the door. Let's just head on through. We don't need to fight those guys yet again. Uh, be careful of the spike traps on the floor. Don't run over them when the spikes are up. Just like any game ever. But, you know, it's worth pointing out since they're there. You know what I mean? Oh, jeez. No, okay, wow. That's why I don't like fighting the mages. Freaking, freaking mages. No, no, no. And, yeah, Lester's probably not going to make it here. I might not make it. Good lord, this guy... This guy is wrecking my day. There we go. Level up. Better than uh, any healing that I could be doing. Doesn't matter, I got to level up. Magic Walnut. Give me my level up and the full heal because of it. Let's put more points in the Thief. Very nice. And we can just avoid these traps and head on through. Now, there should be new enemies. Yes, there are. And that's, that's the sound because Lester was close to death and there he died. As, well, more or less expected, to be honest with you. I don't have high hopes for Lester. I don't have high hopes for anybody that I come across. Is that a dancing sword? How dare you dance, sword. Magic Walnut, I will take it. Anything over here? More dancing swords. No, still no treasure chest, damn it. Animal Bone, once again, I will take it. Head up here. Gotta check the sides. Got a soldier. No, don't hit me, die. Anything over here? Just another soldier. These guys are, of course, easily avoided, but I probably could use the experience. <laughs> yeah, yeah, knock him down, even though he just stands right back up as if nothing happened. Yeah, if it, that's why I like using the sword, because it is a lot faster, but for defeating them, you get the lance, which is probably the best thing here. Now, that has opened up the door. Uh, best thing, I mean, best... Uh, this new equipment, I should say. Well, the you know what I mean, damn it. Uh, you can't do damage to the sword with them, which kind of sucks. Because I would love to show this off. Uh, let's see here. It is a jab, so just like the uh, the bow and the flail, it jabs your enemies. Even though, well, technically it's a little spikier, but that's just a whole other thing. Uh, in terms of its actual damage, where's the lance? It's made of oak, and it doesn't have very much power, to be honest with you. I'll probably still be sticking with the flail, because it works a lot better for me. 
I like the flail. The, the lance isn't bad, but flail's where it's at. Flail is definitely where it's at, so let's move on through here. Do we have new enemies spawning? Uh, we do. It's probably more than just him. Let me take these guys on. Okay, took care of them. I did see a couple chests, and just like I thought, they are polter chests. So let's switch to the mace, which is working out great against these guys, because I can have at least a little distance between me and them when I hit them. Nothing else dropped there. No? Okay. So, let's head over here. There is another chest. I assume it's another polter chest. Oh, mace up. Very nice. Now we can head through here. Let's switch back to the... Actually, is that another polter chest? Damn it. <gasps> I thought I could make it. That is, an, that is a real chest with steel in it. Very nice. Damn it. Let me through. No, we've got upgraded Sergeant Ducks. <gasps> Oh, God, this thing is so slow, though. Uh, give me... No, not the Nux. Give me the sword. We're just going to sword it up in here because this is so much faster. There we go. We got another Scyther thing here. All right, now we can head up here. And... Ah. Freaking polter chest. I figured one of you would be. Oh, one hit. One hit. Not close enough? There we go. What is... Dryad icon. We are racking up the icons. Anything down this way? Uh, no, this, is, this leads to the same room. So let's head down and across. Yeah, if you see the chest spawn, it's, it's not a real chest. This, however, is a real chest with a gumdrop in it. We can head over here. I bet there's another chest. There isn't. Why do you prove me wrong, game? Why do you prove me wrong? Is that a real one? Is that a real one? It is a real one. All right. Give me this chest here, which has a long seat in it. Very nice. Switch back to the sword. Just switching weapons so often in this game. So very often. Uh, nothing down here, but we do have... Well, this guy... Just this one guy? Let me find... No, no, they're hanging out on the other side of the spikes. Let me take these guys on. With them gone, we are free to head up here. And wait for the spikes. And take this guy on. Very nice critical strike. Oh, God. Please tell me that you guys are not guarding polter chests. Damn it. Why? Why is it always polter chests? Ugh. Nope, too f too close. There we go. Then you're real. Hooray! A real chest with a gator skin in it, and one of you is fake, obviously. I don't know which one. That one, far one. Down he goes though, and he spawned a real chest. Uh, but we can get grown steel out of there, and oh, you've got to be kidding me! I grabbed that. I grabbed that. How dare you say I didn't grab that. Alright, let's head out of here and into this door right here. I'm going to take this on left to right. Where are we now? That is a good question. We're in Lord Gronz's room. Really? His room in particular. There's a special barrier. This room will be safe. Bogard, how did you get here? Guard, you're okay. How's Misa? Apparently they've been traveling together. Relax. She's on her way. You guys split up? That is never a good idea. Loki, good thing we caught up with you again. Okay. Huh? Is that you? Willie? Willie? Holy crap, we haven't seen Willie forever. Willie, it is you. Are you still a douche? Loki. Is it really you, Loki? So you are alive, you lucky devil. You guys know each other? Some reunion, huh? We go way back. The two of us have been through hell and back again. Oh, and you'll love this. The day we escaped, Amanda bolted too. Did you bump into her on the outside? Uh, shut up. I hate you. How about Amanda? She didn't make it. What'd you say? Tough break. 
she was always so cheerful. Like I said, this freaking douche Willy, we have to do something quick, or we won't lose. So we won't lose any more friends like Amanda. William, Amanda is my sister. Huh? You're her brother. We met over in Wendell. He's a really good singer. My name is Lester. I'm a minstrel. So you're the brother she was so proud of. You'll have to sing for me sometime. Of course, I'm always singing. Even when I don't get requests. While we're here, we should look for clues to find out if Lord Grons is still alive. I've got a feeling he is. Back in the old days when Grons was in jail, I once heard him singing in his cell. Even if it's a dream, if there's the smallest possibility he's alive, we have to keep believing. Never lose hope. Loki, you're the one to stop Strad. I mean, Dark Lord, for us. For the sake of Grons and Devious, and for Medusa, too. Bogard. Loki, we're the only ones who can stop Dark Lord. It's up to us. Let's go! And Misa has rejoined the party. Got rid of uh, Lester, who I wasn't too fond of, as you, as you might have noticed. He wasn't working out so great for me. Is there any treasure chests in here? There aren't. As you can see, these are uh, pretty much the same room here. Let me take these guys on again. Sergeant Doc! Actually, it looks like I forgot to do something uh, back in the room here. Let's just head inside. We're, we're, we're going to avoid the enemies for now. We need to head up here. And you see he has very nice bookshelves. We need... This is Lord Gronz's diary. We need to read his diary. Fig. Figmund month? Undined. Undined day. What the hell is going on? What the hell? Feekman? I, I don't know. Is that even German? We finally had to part with our dear son, Gurnda. He bears quite a resemblance to his mother and possesses her strong magic. I never imagined he'd have to live in Mavolia. I shan't hold him again. If only he can be happy in Mavolia. There's more! Let's read more of his diary! Duran month. Duran? Like Duran Duran? What? Luna Day, what am I to do? Medusa is growing weaker day by day, but I must. Must I lose not only Gurnda, but Medusa too to Mavolia? I cannot bear it. I must rely on Bogard to use mana power. Bogard, how'd that work out? <laughs>